We can, we can negotiate a millions of free trade agreements and investment agreements and what have you, but if you don't have a business climate back home that is attractive, if you don't have a package that, that sort of attracts domestic and, and foreign investment, uh, you will end up as a loser probably in the long run because there's a huge competition out there for investment and I think uh, Louise alluded to that. So you have to have sort of a stable uh, tax system, you have to have the rule of law, you have to have infrastructure that is, is top notch, you have to have transport, perhaps an educational system, you have to have the possibility for easy licensing, you have to easy financing for SMEs. I mean there's a lot of things into a golden package that you have to put that in place to be attractive. So I think that's something that not only Greek economy and Greece is struggling to put in place. Uh, and we heard some of the very ambitious reforms this morning that was very impressive. I mean, they were in the hundreds. But I mean, even my country, Sweden, is struggling with this. So, so and we have extremely high taxes, for example, uh, and, and, and we have a labor market that is fairly rigid and so forth. So we're all struggling with it. So uh, that's my more general uh, uh, comment to that. Sorry that I'm not going into more, no recipe for the Greek economy.